<laughs> now I've got you, you little son of a devil! Huh? Stay still, kid! We're gonna have a talk! Fuck! Huh? Where are we at? Just killed him. The morgue key. We know what we need to do now. No. That Dr. Shitface Hill told on me again. What'd you do? Nothing. What the fuck? What? Wait for it. Hmm. Seems like oh no. Please say it killed the guy with the key. There we go. Simple. In the morning they had a back door to bring my car in. This was where we would end up meeting. Eventually soon I'm going to try and get the cremate to get rid of evidence. I need another key. Oh no, I've got it. There we go. What the fuck? He's over there. Just has to get through that door, get to the getaway car, and that would be the perfect time to do that for. So I'll plan this when he leaves. Right, I'll try and position these.
No. Yeah. Ah, it's spewing blood everywhere. You're dead. Jason. The Morticianer key to it. Of course it does. Of course this isn't actually an opening, it's just a thing. Oh, acid. Perfect. Hi. Oh, you're gonna regret coming sniffing around here. I missed. Regret coming sniffing around here. Lagging to hell. I'm pretty sure he just busted my bottle of acid. Regret coming sniffing around here. I keep missing. Try a different way. I'm pretty sure he just made me break. Fucking cunt. Oh no wait, we need pliers for that, don't we? No, is it pliers? Yeah, pliers. How do I call him though? Two, 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 three. Hey, you're going for questioning right now. Oi, no, come back. Dumbass. For questioning right now. <coughs> Got him. Not the easiest way to do it. I kind of lost the jar of acid because I was derping a lot, but got there in the end. And done. We are out of the hospital. Ah, just having a celebratory drink. Come on, loading. I could see it in his eyes. He was worried. It seems that he wasn't the only one trying to earn a place on his father's throne. There was another, and he was already a step ahead. The connection had been severed. No more nightly visits from Lucifer.
No more holding hands and telling them what to do. It was a competition, and there could only be one. The one who was able to fulfill the prophecies would gain the powers needed to sit on the lap of the one true evil. If unable, all others would perish with all the rest of the mortals while the apocalypse would sit upon the living world. This was all preparation for the final conflict between heaven and earth. The final conflict that would revitalize humanity and create a new beginning. Whose beginning? It remains to be seen. hospital and we are finally in the Crane's town of Ludlow which is in a big massive up area and it's gonna be the frame rate's gonna be a bit shit sorry about that folks but it's the only way I'm gonna be able to play this game so find a Bible find a way to get a Bible why would we need a Bible find a map look for clues start a fire on the cornfield cornfield with a missing D, Confield. So, there we go. Finally left the hospital. I wonder if we can upgrade some of these. Oh, we can. We can start get rid of, get, get rid of. Is that power? That's still not a power. I don't get that. We can finally start getting rid of bodies now. So we, people won't see them. And yeah, I need to go find myself some health because I had to do a few lifelines there. No down to half health, but oh my god. <coughs> Pardon me, that's the coke speaking. But yes, finally, out of the hospital, in Ludlow, we can start running around and just killing people who aren't uh, patients, doctors and nurses, and touching babies to make them grow up into Freddy Krueger and Jason Voorhees and cannibals and other such things. Oh, it's been a good day after having some trouble with the fourth level. Fifth level went a lot smoother than the fourth level did. Fifth level? Yeah, fifth level. Yeah, so yep, I shall see you all next time for some more Lucius 2 Prophecy where we shall have a gander about this quaint town of Ludlow. So see you all next time. Goodbye. Yeah.